This is a true master of the skies. With its exceptional maneuverability, advanced avionics, and powerful weapons, the F-22 is a formidable opponent in the air. It is out of your mind. The F-22 Raptor is widely considered one of the most advanced fighter jets in the world. Developed for the United States Air Force, this fifth-generation stealth aircraft is designed for air superiority and can engage in various missions, including ground attack, electronic warfare, and signals intelligence. One of the key features of the F-22 is its exceptional maneuverability. The aircraft is equipped with highly advanced avionics, including a cutting-edge integrated sensor suite and stealth technology. This combination of technology and engineering allows the F-22 to outmaneuver and outsmart its opponents in air-to-air -air combat. The F-22's incredible agility can be attributed to its unique design. The aircraft features a thrust vectoring engine, which gives it the ability to vector its exhaust in any direction. This allows the F-22 to rapidly change direction and perform maneuvers that would be impossible for other aircraft. In addition to its incredible maneuverability, the F-22 is also equipped with a suite of air-to-air -air missiles, including the AIM-120 AMRAAM and the AIM-9 Sidewinder. These weapons, combined with the F-22's advanced sensor suite, give the aircraft a significant advantage in air-to-air -air combat. Despite its advanced capabilities, the F-22 has faced criticism over its cost and limited operational role compared to other military aircraft. Nevertheless, the F-22 remains a valuable asset to the United States Air Force and continues to play a critical role in protecting us airspace and supporting us military operations around the world. So what are the precise G-limits of the F-22? Generally, fighter pilots can handle greater head-to-toe G-forces, up to 8 or 9 Gs, and for longer periods by wearing anti-G suits. These specialized outfits use air bladders to constrict the legs and abdomen during high Gs to keep blood in the upper body. Therefore, the maximum Gs of twin to aircraft can pull are 9 Gs. After 9 Gs, permanent change will occur in different parts of the aircraft. The typical gravitational force at the surface of the planet we call home is 1 g, or 9.8 meters per second squared, and is easily withstanding by humans. However, even here on Earth, some situations, such as driving in a fast automobile, might produce more than that. For example, Formula One drivers have been known to experience up to 6 g's when turning at high speeds. Up in the air, the air force is almost always higher than one. A pilot who has received the right training in gear can sustain 9 Gs while maintaining functionality. Actually, nobody knows the upper limit in terms of aircraft. It's generally agreed some of these flying metal birds can pull up to 15 Gs and don't break apart, but given how literally no one reached that, it's hard to say what's the limit. The G limits of an aircraft refer to the maximum amount of force, expressed as a multiple of Earth's gravity, that the aircraft can withstand during flight maneuvers. In the other words, the G limits define the maximum amount of positive or pull up and negative or push down Gs that an aircraft can handle before structural damage or pilot incapacitation occurs. 
The F-22 Raptor's G-limits are classified and not publicly available. However, it is known that the aircraft has a highly advanced flight control system that allows it to perform complex maneuvers and operate at high G-forces. The F-22's digital flight control system is capable of automatically controlling the aircraft to maintain stability and prevent exceeding its G-limits. This makes it a highly maneuverable and capable air-to-air -air fighter. The specific G-limit for the F-22 may also vary depending on factors such as altitude, airspeed, and other environmental conditions.